So it's legit venison and chocolate. <laughs> Kiwi Parenting Advice 101. Don't forget to blow on the pie. That's what she said. Queenstown, so this poor, poor girl is shivering. I'm gonna put this on her. So two weeks ago we left Queenstown to go to Dunedin to help my cousin move to her new house. Oh, I'm sorry Luna, did I wake you up? I forgot you were there. Two weeks later we are back in Queenstown for two reasons. The primary reason is uh, to help our friends house it. <coughs> and uh, they asked us if we could uh, look after the house and uh, feed the dogs. And the second reason why we're back in Queenstown is there is a festival that's going on in Arrowtown. It's called Pie, Pint, and Pino. Probably the coolest sounding name for a food festival. It is forecasted to rain a lot. Fingers crossed we get some good weather for this Pie, Pino, and Pint. No. Pie, Pie, Pino. Holy I think it was Jesus. Pint, Pie, Pino. P Pino pot. I think it was pint. Do you remember what it was, Charlie? Arrowtown is absolutely stunning this time of year. You got those autumn oranges and reds and yellows popping. Town is a lot prettier around this time of year. I'm guessing this is the historic Arrowtown post office. Every New Zealand town has the word historic in front of something. Historic post office, historic town, historic bridge, historic plaque, historic rock, historic plaque on a rock. Oh, this event geez. is sold out Jesus. as you can tell by this enormous line over here. Hello. Yeah, the GoPro won't work, I don't think, on this one. <laughs> yeah, you've got two here. Yeah. 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 And anything you don't spend, you can get refunded or donate back to the festival. The wine glass, please. Yeah. Thank you. I guess the pint glass for the man. That's so cool. We charged our cards. We're inside finally after waiting in line for about 20 minutes. This is the longest we've had to wait in line anywhere in New Zealand. And we're ready to get down to eating some pies and beers. Wait, the tasters are 250 to 3 bucks. Hey look, it's your favorite winery, Akarua. You must be excited. These guys do a venison and chocolate pie. So that's basically deer and chocolate. Gotta be very selective with the pie that I choose. Unfortunately, I'm not Mike Chen. I'm not Kobayashi. I've got a tiny little stomach, so I could eat one, maybe two pies at the most. The plan is to eat first, line our stomachs with something, and then just sample as much beer as we can. I'm getting angry, and I'm getting really impatient. <laughs> Cheers, thanks. I committed to the beef moussaka from Frank's Pantry. Nice egg wash, it's nice and lubricated on top, nice and shiny. Is there, is there bechamel in it? There's bechamel. I knew it. Oh my god. Oh, I'm so How hungry. That was so good. <laughs> you have to take a bite of it. Mm. I love moussaka. That is insane. Holy Jesus. Mm. 
bursting with flavor. Yum. That is a good pie. Oh, that's so good. Can you taste the nutmeg? Holy what did you get? Malt ginger beer. It is steaming. This is a good sized pie. I can at least have a couple of these without getting too full. Yeah. So far, we're one for one on the delicious pie scale. Rainbow plume, bridge roll for Wild venison <laughs> and kofi duck that looks like a Cornish pasty, and I'm biting. I got mostly dough that time. Hold on. along. <laughs> I don't think we should have started off with the moussaka one because that one I think has spoiled the rest of the pies that we're gonna eat today. Uh, yeah, winning combination. Lynn's gonna start her second pie. I'm gonna start my first beer. I find that at these beer festivals, I usually don't care what beer I'm getting. It's just, uh, uh, yeah, get me that hazy IPA, whatever. You know. <laughs> All right, what do you got there, Ling? <gasps> venison chocolate. Ling went for the venison chocolate. Very ambitious move. Let's see how this goes down. I love venison and I love chocolate and I'm <laughs> sure they taste delicious together. <laughs> Don't spill your drink. I got mostly pastry. <laughs> That's always I'm, the not, I'm not very good at first bites. <laughs> <laughs> Can I get uh, half a pilsner? Yeah, no worries. <laughs> oh my goodness. This is a half <laughs> Wow! That's a very generous half. You know it's a pie festival wearing crumbs. It's on my skin. This is the Pilsner from Arrowtown Brewing Company. Hoppier Pilsner, which I like. Some IPAs I find are a bit too strong, but this is a hoppy Pilsner. And it's, a, it's a good good balance. This is this is a taste. This is a half. That's always a most generous half pie. Why, why pay for a full when you can just get generous half. This tastes like bad bread. Chin chin. I think I want a beef moussaka. We're back at Frank's pantry. That beef moussaka was fire. Potato top mint. It's a classic. I imagine they make a good one. Um, can I get a steak and ale? What did you get? White chocolate brulee cheese pie tart. It's a fun. It's like a lecture bun that was creme brulee and a really nice crust. This is so good. I can't even. And pie number four. To go with your pino, pie, pino, pie, pino, pie, pino, pie. beer, pint, pie. You're the pint. 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 No! <laughs> I took a bite. Look, crumb.